is now we welcome in Gabby DiGello. Uh, two weeks ago, she was Defensive Player of the Week in the MAC Commonwealth, and want to come on in, Gabby. Come on, join us here tonight. Appreciate Hi. it. I know this is tough. I don't know if you just draw this, drew the short, short straw, and that's why you're the one that came up here. But I know it's got to be tough you to look do this. Scary though. I know. Yeah, right. Very intimidating. Very intimidating. I appreciate it. I'm going to give you the same question I just gave Coach. How do you guys pick each other up after you know a week like this where you suffer two tough losses? Well, we have our KD on Saturday, so I think practice tomorrow and practice on Friday needs to be filled with a lot of positivity and good things and just supporting each other and then having a really good game on Saturday, you know, having a really good win against Arcadia to lift us up and kind of swing our momentum into a direction that we should be going in and that we want to be going in towards the playoffs. So, Being one of the leaders on this team, how do you keep the younger players your coach always talks about we have a lot of youth on this mm -hmm. team how do you keep the younger players in it feeling good about themselves and feeling good about the team and that you still have a lot of season in front of you well we try to make sure that younger girls are engaged and just talking to them reassuring them positive things um, making sure they're getting reps and just kind of talking them through and leading them through mistakes that we all make and we have made and we continue to make and just lifting them up and kind of bringing us all together as a unit is a good way to get them. This feels, I don't want to say this divisively, but can you take pride in what you're doing defensively right now, even though the results maybe aren't as, as a team where you want them to be? Obviously we make mistakes, but I think as a unit, over the past couple of games, we have really showed up and stepped up and really kind of grasped the defen uh, uh, team defense that we have been looking for all season and it's kind of all meshing together um, down there and it's showing on the clears how we're working together and the ball movement so I would say that we do have a lot of things to be proud of but of course there's always a ton of room for improvement. It seems like none of you are afraid to go and try to help on the other side of the field. It seems like all of you are more than willing to try to go, you know, mix it up and go the other way as you need to. Yeah, everybody wants a goal once in a while, so <laughs> <laughs> you got to go for it sometimes. Yeah. Hope the outcome's good. Gabby, I know this is tough, so I really appreciate you coming and doing this. You certainly, you, you looked really scary. I got to be honest with you. I'm terrified right now. So best of luck this weekend, and hope with the next time we chat, it's after a big win, all right? Yes, definitely. I hope so, too. Gabby, all right. thank you so much. Thank you, Gabby DeJello coming up here to hang out with us after a tough one.